you guys, Nikki here for a hangout vlog slash I don't know what's happening video. So, hey. Oh no. I thought, why not make a getting ready with me video and hang out with you guys because I have a bunch of new subscribers and I thought I'd say hey. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna do my hair, my makeup. I have nowhere to go. I'm gonna wash it off after. I just felt like this would be fun. And I forgot I worked this morning and I have spray nine in my hair. So that's cool. <laughs> so it's like crusty and sticky. Oh no. I was gonna straighten it, but maybe we won't. I just thought I'd sneak on here in a in between witchy Wednesdays and just kind of touch base. It's been a while since I've done a vlog. I haven't really talked to you guys for a while. Just thought I'd say hello. So how's it go? Oh, oh no. I honestly don't usually wear makeup, like, ever. Usually this is what I look like. I don't know how to do makeup. I know you're supposed to use brushes. I'm not gonna. I don't know, man. I saw this video Jeffree Star did a while ago where it, it was like a tutorial that his grandmother sent him of what they used to do makeup, and it was all with their hands. It probably doesn't blend as well, but I get a, a shade that's so close to my skin that you can barely see it anyways. I don't have a lot of blemishes little flex. So I don't really have much to cover. Okay, I put way too much in my hands. I'm just gonna <laughs> rub it in and it's cream, right? <laughs> We're just gonna put it on like it's cream. Makeup gurus everywhere are cringing. Uh. Gotta get it down the neck. No lines here. I remember this girl in elementary school when she first started wearing foundation, she had it like orange and there was a solid line. And I'm like, we're not gonna do that. <laughs> How is everyone? How's it going? What's new? Let me know. It's been a hot minute. <laughs> How's it going, man? I didn't realize how many of my friends that I've lost touch with are watching these videos. So thank you so much for being here. You guys are awesome. I really appreciate all of your support, all of my subscribers. You guys are so great. These are like spots that light up. Am I supposed to spread it over my whole chin? I don't know, but we're doing it. I guess I haven't really done a video since I moved into our new place. I guess I kind of stopped doing vlogs because no one was viewing them and no one really gave a damn. I don't blame you because they're terrible. If you look back at my old videos, like it's cringy. I didn't know how to start them. I still don't really know how to do an intro. And the content's lame. Like I lived in a camper. That was pretty interesting stuff, but my videos weren't. So I, yeah, I don't know. I just. Witchy Wednesdays, I when I have a day off, I film like three of them so that they're ready to go in a lineup because I work so much that I just don't have time to do them once a week. So I, I pre-order them. So pre-orders, if you like want to request a video, there's it's going to be like the fourth video because I've already filmed two. So it's going to be like way down in March, but I will get to it. So if you do want to request a video, leave a comment. Let me know. I got you. I am super excited because Devin is actually out right now. He saw on Facebook, he's been kind of keeping his eye out for free lumber because we're building a chicken coop. So it's not gonna be like a really fancy one. It's gonna be kind of not slapped together, but something that we can take down if we decide to buy property and move out of this place. Something we can take with us, but we're probably gonna end up getting like 30 chickens. So I was thinking about getting like 20 adults and maybe 10 babies. Babies will have to get next spring, but I was thinking, if you guys are interested, I could totally film the process of getting chickens and what it's like and how we prepare for that. If you want to see that, let me know because chickens are great. I grew up with chickens. I grew up on a chicken farm, so I freaking love chickens. They're dope. Plus, it helps with the garden, so. Nothing else is new. I live kind of a boring life. Honestly, I do nothing but work constantly. Also, I ran out of I am um, blush, so I've just been using one of these eyeshadows. <laughs> oh. oh no. Just need to give myself a little color because I'm like a ghost. Okay, I don't know what to do for eyes. Should we do red? Let's go fancy. Let's let's get let's get into it. Put some eye primer on. God I'm getting wrinkly. Look at those oh no. I'm not gonna be able to wear this much makeup on my eyes for much longer so I'm just getting old over here. I just saying that because my birthday is next week. Actually it's in like four days. And I'm 26 and I feel like I'm getting so old. <laughs> Anyone older than me is probably hating me right now, but I'm at that point in my life where I'm like, oh, I am wrinkly. I'm starting to like age. I can't lose weight like I used to be able to. This kind of sucks. Like I'm not a huge fan. I'm at that age where your metabolism slows and you're starting to realize you're not invincible. And I don't love it. <laughs> 
It kind of sucks. <laughs> I have this huge fear of growing old and just not knowing who I am. How do I look? All done. <laughs> I guess I do live kind of a boring existence. I wake up, I work, I come home and I clean. I mean, the dogs have two and a half acres to run fully fenced now, so I don't usually have to walk them. So they're doing their own thing. And we don't really have people come over all the time. So their training is kind of at a standstill because they're... the main reason I was training them so much when I lived in the camper is because they are on leash aggressive because they weren't trained on leashes when they were young. So. I uh, was trying so hard to get them so that they'd be good in public and now that they have all the space to run, I can take them out one at a time. I don't have all three tied up outside the camper. I need to paint. I see that in the back. We still, we're so busy. We moved in and we touched up the whole house so we're like, yeah, we're gonna paint the whole place. We're gonna pick all our new colors and we get to decide what colors everything is gonna be even though we're renting, which is super cool. And we're just so busy, we haven't had any time. That's why I'm also kind of not huge onto uploading several times a week because I just, I need to have time for my life, you know? YouTube is so time consuming. Not hating on it. I do love, I do absolutely love doing this. I don't even care if I don't get monetized. I need a thousand subscribers to do that. But I don't care if that doesn't happen because I'm not doing this to get famous and make money. I'm doing this because I like doing it. I like filming videos. I like editing it. It's fun for me. And it's kind of cool being able to see and document the process of what it was like living in a camper so that years later I could show my kids that because it's on the internet. My family could keep tabs on what I'm up to, you know? I, I kind of like it for that aspect. I can show my kids like, yeah, this is what I used to do before you were born. <laughs> I just kind of look like I got punched and I'm bleeding out the side of my eye. All right, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm going to fix it. It's going to be fine. I look fine. I looked better before. It's okay. Makeup sucks. I don't know. I'm not very good at makeup. Should we add purple? I just don't like purple and red together. I don't know why, it just bothers me. I mean, if I do purple, I'm gonna have to cover the whole thing up. And I don't wanna add cool colors because it's already so warm. I don't wanna like contradict. What is going on with the internet? All of Gen Z millennial youngins need to calm down because they are just canceling all the good things in the world. Like Mr. Potato Head, what's that about? What did he ever do to anybody? Because his name's Mr. Like, I don't understand how they're trying to, I think this is so funny, how those youngins are trying to get Eminem canceled from TikTok, like he gives a damn. <laughs> I just, I think I've been watching so many videos on this lately. I just think it's so funny that they're upset about the lyrics from Love the Way You Lie. Like, the, what? <laughs> it's like the most minor lyric out of all of his music. And if you listen to the song, Rihanna's like, something about she likes the way it burns. She's she's into it. No one's coming after Riri. Well, why would they? She's a queen, but why are they going after him and him? What did he even do? He's just angry. Leave him alone. Let him live his life. No one's gonna cancel him. Remember that time that they tried? Not they. Do you remember that time that, um, what's that rapper's name challenged him? Oh, I laughed so hard. <sighs> what's his name? But he tried to challenge Eminem and I was just so excited for that video to come out. Okay, you know what? I've decided to go over the red because I'm not living for it. And we're going over with a like forest green. And it's not going to be forest green in my eyes. It's just going to kind of dull down the red and make it look a little more brown. Is this how you do it? I don't know what I'm doing and that's okay. Cool. My life literally is 26. I'm like, this is as good as we're going to get. We're going downhill from here. You gotta embrace it. Not much is getting better here, okay? Okay, eyebrows. Coloring them in because I've been growing them out since I was 19. If you see pictures of me from when I was younger, Actually, I should show you how bad, they're bad. They are bad. I don't wanna talk about it. They're, I just, I don't know, I wanted them thin and pretty and then I just never stopped plucking them and I'm still trying to grow them back. And it's not like they're not growing, they're just, I get impatient and pluck them into the wrong shape again and have to re-outgrow them. So that's what's, that's what's going on. Boom. 
See, like it's basically exactly the way it was. It's just a little bit more fierce. Now, this eyebrow is kind of where I want it, but <laughs> if you look at like the exact measurements, that's how much more I have to grow. <laughs> you can see it now. It's like off my face. Now, you're supposed to replace your eyeliner and mascara every six months, and I'm trying to save up for a car, so I have not done that, and it is so dried out. It's really hard to get a clean line. Hope you enjoy watching me screw this up. Ready? Because I'm not. Just trying to do eyeliner for as long as I can until my eyes are nasty. <laughs> I've got pretty good eyelids, I think. There's some room to play. One day I think I'm just gonna lose it and shave off my eyebrows like Jeffree Star and just be like, what? Now my makeup can go up to here. Fight me. I can't talk when I do this. Stop interrupting. It's just hard to get a clean line with this dry ass eyeliner. I think I did okay. My mascara is also dried right out, but I have naturally pretty long lashes, so I don't usually wear fakes. They're just annoying. I feel like my eyelids are wearing a hat and it's shady. My name is Dickie and my life is boring and you're here to watch it. What are you doing with your life? Seriously, what are you doing that you're watching this entire video? Do you have nothing better to do? Go outside or, you know, subscribe. Now that I look bomb as hell, we're moving on. <laughs> this really dry mascara. Like I used to use coconut oil as a makeup remover. I'm like, oh, my skin is so dry. I'm just gonna use this for everything. Not in your hair, obviously, but I'm gonna use it on my skin, on my eczema, on my back. Then my sister messaged me. She goes, you know that dries your skin out, right? I'm like, no way. I Googled it. It's literally causing my eczema. So if you have dry skin, don't use coconut oil. Hubs from Costco, oh no. Jesus, take the wheel, I'm out. What was I talking about? <laughs> this sucks that you're not really here because usually you could be like, oh, you're talking about this. And I'd be like, oh yeah. I don't, I'm just talking to myself here though. And I have the worst memory ever, like ever. I don't know how to contour and I'm not gonna pretend I do. I have a really rectangle face. Do you ever notice that? And I have a witch's nose. That's why I pierced it. I always pierce things about myself I don't like. That way people look at the gem instead of my weird ass crooked nose. That's not crooked, it just curves down and it's stupid. Anyways, <laughs> you know, I wanna add some sparkles. Sparkles, 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 sparkles. I wish you could see this makeup in real life because it's actually dope. Like I did a really good job. I don't mean to like toot my own horn, but toot, you know? Ooh, I'm really happy. I'm glad I put that green on to tone the red down. They actually say that in hairdressing. Like, that's a thing. If you have red in your hair, you need to put green on it. If you have yellow in hair, you put purple on it, and it tones it down. So, I guess the same as with makeup, because that definitely diluted it. And it's not green, and it's not red. But it's pretty, you know? Okay. Lips? Huh? I think so. Hot Pink by Jeffree Star. I know y'all hate them. I don't care. <laughs> I'm not gonna hate someone just because everybody else does. Sure, you pissed off the internet at one point, whatever, I like his makeup. You know what I like the best about this? It smells like candy and it looks bomb and then it dries. So it goes on wet and then it dries and it lasts all day. I wanna get his like red. I wanted to get red, but they were sold out, so I got hot pink. It was supposed to be sparkly, but I guess I, I picked the wrong one, but I still like it. It's more of a like hot Barbie pink in person. This looks a little bit more red on camera. Okay, I guess we're on hair. I don't know what to do about the spray nine though. I guess we could curl it. Should we curl it? But like the thing about my hair is it's so flat, I have no volume and then it curls at the bottom. So when I curl it, I usually have to pin it up so it does something. I should probably brush it. So my phone died and I have to use a different phone and the camera's a lot better. Oh no. I don't look as good as I did with the other phone. <laughs> you can really see how caked on my makeup is now, hey? Oh, you can really see how I fucked up with the eyeliner though. That's fine. 
It's not like I'm gonna wear it for more than five minutes. Anyway, so joke's on you. I like it. Oh no. Always start at the bottom, guys, when you're brushing your hair. If you've got long hair or knotty hair, always start at the bottom. Work your way through the spray nine. <laughs> if you're wondering what spray nine is, it's like a disinfectant. If you don't want to use bleach, a lot of mechanic shops use it. Oh, it feels so gross. That's the downside to this job is I'm not doing hair as much. I'm doing hair more on the side for friends and family. Owie. I'm working labor on a farm and I have to get like my head right down in these barrels to clean them and I have to use spray nine and so it gets all up in my hair. Okay, I don't know what to do. I was gonna make it all pretty. You know what I kinda wanna do is just braid it. But that's boring, I do that every day. Oh well. All right. Doom, 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 doom. Yes. If you're wondering what's on my shirt right here, um, it's plant food. <laughs> I spilt some on my shirt today. I think I hear Devin coming home. I like how he drives, just arm hanging out. <laughs> Hopefully he got a bunch of free lumber for our chicken coop. I mean, obviously we'll go buy nice lumber if we need to, but if people are just giving away lumber that we can just sand down, heck yeah. And what I do, <sighs> the amount of selfies I take are kind of obnoxious, but I'm doing it because I'm freaking out that I'm aging and I like to document my skin and my face and how pretty I look now before I turn into a raisin of an old lady. You know, I'm glad I've taken all the photos I did. I wish I took more when I was a kid because I just grew so fast, you know? Now I'm aging so fast. It's just stay 26 forever, but like still be mature. I'm all gustied up and ready to go nowhere. Thank you so much for hanging out. If you stayed for the whole video, I don't blame you if you didn't. This is probably pretty boring, but if you're invested in my life and you want to know what I'm up to, there you have it. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you for being here. Feel free to comment to let me know how you're doing and any requests you have. And feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Love you guys. Bye. Whoa. Good exit, right? It's annoying how much. <laughs> You don't care because I'm going to edit that part out, so you don't get to see it. What are you questioning me for, elephants? Come on. <coughs> Hear me out. Elephants in BC. Right? Okay. Lips. Like you're just walking your dog. Boom. Elephant. Why? Why not? Go get some from Africa and bring them here and let them hang out. Come on, let's go. Okay, get on it, government. You know what to do. Oh, sorry. I think it'd be dope to just have wild elephants running around like horses. Like, yeah, cool, Brenda, your horse is really cool. I got an elephant in my backyard, so he just wandered there and I clean his face sometimes. <laughs> I'll stop.